Get in here, get in here, get in here. Everybody got the round. I got a gift for you. I got a gift for the peoples who donated to my cash app. I'm about to give them a gift of a lifetime. But you see this Google Drive? Whatever I give you, make sure you put it on your drive. ASAP. It's that serious. So I told a lot of peoples that I was going to give them one of the biggest gifts, right? And this gift has something to do with court documents that I normally don't give out. So I want to give it out to the peoples who donated their tools and fuels. And in this court document, it tells a lot about your history, who was involved in your history, even the schools, even the Bureau of Indian Affairs. Everybody's involved in this document, what I'm about to give you, only because you donated to the cash app. Now, copy this number, take a screenshot, please, ASAP. Take a screenshot. And as you can see, bam, got something to do with that, right? As you can see right here, take a screenshot, please. Now, as you can see, this is the only two places on the internet that you can download literally the whole document that got something to do with us that was hidden in history. You can't find it on the internet, so don't even try. You can only go here, ASAP. Now, in this document, if you go close right here, and as you can see, it literally... Go all the way back to 1902. It go all the way back to 1901. And as you can see, black Indian descendants. And it talks about entitlement to land, allotments, money, and everything you wanted to know. Everything you wanted to know. As you can see right here, it talks about the five tribes, right? And if you go up here, it's called the Harvard Institute of Freedmen, Plaintiff, Department of Interior. Here go the judge right here, Robert. And as you can see, they tried to dismiss the case. So once you read this, it's going to blow your mind on how much we is owed. And it's about to make sense why you're trying to give us this $12,000 a month. So let me give you a little commentary before I continue. Basically, they tried to have who we are so they can wait to a certain amount of time and take the land. But what they did is actually messed up because when Dr. Martin Luther King did the public law 90284, it actually put us back in the right status under the treaties. Okay, so under the treaties. So what they did or tried to do it say, ooh, African American. So now it go back. If you clearly read, I don't know if you can see it. That's why I say it. It tried to put us under custodian and fiduciary relationships with the so-called five civilized tribes, and we even get compensation for damages. Right? It's a lot. In oh my god, it's so much stuff in here. You're going to need about two hours to read all these documents. And you're going to need all these documents. And I'm telling you, I love you. When you read it, you're going to come back and you're going to be in my inbox or you're going to come to this page and you're going to say, thank you for this gift. And you can even say that you discovered it because you got the documents. And when you read the documents, it's going to blow your mind. So now ask yourself, who built all these pyramids? Who built all these mounds? Who owned all the land that's still in the Lodeo title? We do. So now you're about to find out clearly while Washington, D.C. closed down, Britain closed down, and those who call themselves the Jays going through what they're going through because we still prisoners of war. But when you read this document, you're entitled to a lot of bread, my friend. And this is what I'm thinking. Wherever you stay at, whatever home, you own that home and you own that land. Because we ain't get the 40 acres of the mules. Once you read this, you're about to understand we're rich, baby. We're rich. So if you like this, donate to the cash shop, please.